In this video, we will learn how to open, read, and navigate the reports. Let's start with the key drivers report. Under the report name, you will find a brief reminder of what it represents. In this case, questions that are statistically significant with respect to a parishioner's likelihood to recommend the parish. Say the parish is helping them grow spiritually and frequency with which they are sharing their faith. Below that, you will notice your parish name and next to it, the year the DMI survey was taken. Notice there's a drop down menu. This is for parishes who have taken the DMI multiple times. They can choose which year's results they want to look at. And finally, at the top to the right, you can export a PDF of the screenshot by clicking on this blue button, export PDF. This report provides insight into what CLI has identified as the three most important outcome questions on the survey. Those three questions are, I would recommend my parish to a friend. My parish helps me grow spiritually as a Catholic and frequency of sharing one's witness story. These outcome questions are overall measurements for the health of the parish. The first outcome question is, I would recommend my parish to a friend. If you've ever been asked to provide feedback for any retail location, theme park, car rental service, or even senior doctor lately, you would likely be asked this question. In market research, the likelihood to recommend has been identified as the best predictor of future growth or decline. But we aren't Hertz Rent-A-Car nor Home Depot. We have a deeper mission. We also identified my parish helps me grow spiritually as a Catholic as another outcome question. A parish's competency and perception at impacting the spiritual growth of its people is a metric of the parish's health. Finally, to assess the spirit of missionary discipleship within the parish, we looked at one of the frequency questions, how frequently does a parishioner share their personal witness with another person as one way to understand the missionary spirit in our parishes? CLI consulted with data experts to do further research as to what drives individuals to say these things about their parish, and we have highlighted these outcome questions and the associated drivers to help direct your focus. You can dive into all the questions, but we think it is prudent to start here. We will go further in depth by how to understand these drivers during your first webinar. To the left of each of the colored bars is a moniker or shorthand identifying a survey question that represents a given driver for a key outcome question. Let's take a look at that. It's right down here on the left side. The colored bars represent the results of a five scale response. The color legend is over to the right. So let's go over there. And you can see it ranges from strongly agree, which is the dark blue, all the way up to a, a dark gold of strongly disagree, these gradations all the way through. Let's look at some other ways you can navigate or view the data. Underneath each moniker of a survey question, you will see show table. Let's go over there. When selecting this, you see the percentages visualized as actual numbers. If you want to display in a PDF, be sure to keep it open and then select export PDF. When you hover over a percentage, you will see some more specifics about the response percentages, including the raw number of respondents for each color coded option. So if I hover over 17, remember that the dark blue is strongly agree. And what the pop up is showing is total responses of 30. So 30 folks completed this particular question. And of the 30, five respondents strongly agree that they would recommend the pastor to a friend. And as you go across each of these, you can see how it changes and provides you with that detail. You also have the option to filter a report by a specific demographic to gain some deeper insights, such as by age. And to do that, click on the down arrow in the select a question area. There's a drop down, age. Then go ahead and select a response, and it's a particular range. 
Notice that the percentages on the report have changed and now only represent the responses from that specific demographic filter. You can do this in other reports as well. While data itself is helpful, it is most valuable when put into a larger context. To that end, Catholic leadership has provided a snapshot of your data side by side with several comparatives. We call this benchmarking. To find this report, click on the upper left link, go to reports dashboard, then select the report called benchmarks. And then go to benchmarks here. You can select any one question on the survey and see how your results compare to data from parishes of similar size and setting with the entire data set across the United States and Canada, as well as other parishes in your specific diocese who have taken the survey. The context these results provide will allow you to learn from your neighbors or similar parishes and share ideas and best practices. We've selected Bible study or prayer group. Notice the results are in green and gray. These colors represent frequency questions. The color legend is over to the right. So once again, as we just looked at earlier, this is a different legend because it pertains to frequency and it goes from dark green daily all the way to gray is never. You will also notice the option to select group daily, weekly, and monthly. Selecting this will do just that, group these three frequencies together. Notice how the data display changes when grouping these. Some find this helpful when analyzing the results. Now let's look at the benchmarking. Go over here to the left. The first result is your parish. The top three parishes represent the parishes with the highest frequency in our entire database. That's here. The next display is the average of all parishes in our database. My parish year to year is when you've taken the DMI more than once. You'll see the different years there and it'll have that comparison. Then the diocesan average, followed by parishes with similar attendance, parishes within this particular setting of like urban in this case, uh, as well as small parishes. So it's comparing all of the parishes who answered this particular question and putting it into these contexts. So you can compare how your results compare with the overall. While this data is interesting, we suggest that you start by looking at the key drivers report, then your strengths and opportunities report to see how it aligns with the key drivers. From there, we hope you are naturally curious and want to know more by filtering and cross tabulating questions. Let's try one cross tabulation. So we're going to go back up to go, uh, go to reports dashboard and go to the cross tabulation report. And here you can compare any question to another question. So for example, let's pick pace of spiritual growth and ethnicity and race. And what you find is that for these different ethnicities that were represented in this particular parish, those folks that answered these questions, uh, they're showing what, where their pace of spiritual growth is. This is extremely helpful if you want to test a hypothesis that you have. And for those that are really into data, it's a lot of fun as well. We know that you'll be excited to share your data with your faithful parishioners in the pews, but we suggest waiting until you had time with CLI to go through the data before widely sharing the results. Without context and strategic communications, these raw numbers can be misconstrued in ways you may not have intended. Finally, we ask for your prayerful support as we journey through this process together. The Disciple Maker Index is invaluable in supporting your parish and diocese. Know that you are not alone, and we will be walking with you every step of the way. You and your communities will be in our prayers as we go through these results together. We hope this two-part video was helpful to get you started looking through your results. Please email us at 
dmi at catholicleaders.org if you have any questions or need technical support.